Hi, welcome to More Than a Conquer. Today we're going to be talking about following Christ and how it can be difficult sometimes. Um, mainstream Christianity, if you will, I feel like um, the message in this generation and what we mostly hear is that it's great and he's going to do all these great for you, things for you and everything is going to be rosy and you know, all of these amazing things, but then, you know, as you go through life, you're like, what is this difficult thing? And how come there's this hard thing? And what is all this? You know, and, and it can be discouraging. Um, but the Bible says the truth is, is that we will encounter tribulation and hardships. There will be things coming against us. We do have an enemy who's constantly trying to throw us off track. And I feel like a lot of times God's trying to save us from ourselves. You know, he's trying to get out all of the greed and all of the like impurities, all of the lustful desires and envy and jealousy and, you know, all of these things that just hurt us. And when we go through a difficult time, we often run to those things, but they only do us more damage. So a lot of times he's trying to put in his love for the dysfunction we may have went through in childhood, or he's trying to put in um, peace for anxiety. And so we're used to dealing with problems one way and he's trying to teach us a new way and that can be really difficult sometimes. You know, there's there's a scripture in the Bible that says that the world runs after all of these like physical things. You know, we all want a great career, a great car, a great house, like all of those things. And he says, um, chase after the kingdom and I'll give you all those things. And I was thinking about it one day, like, you know, why do I, why do, why does everyone want those things, those great things, status, you know? And it's because we think that it will bring us joy and happiness and peace and stability and significance and all of those great things. When God is saying, I just want to give those things to you. I want you to see that I, that you can get them from me and not from all of these other things. And so um, I would just encourage you to push deeper with God and ask for those things. Like when I'm struggling, when things aren't going the way that I want them to, I'll ask for his peace and his joy. And no matter what's going on that day, I get those things. Those are the things that he wants you to ask for. Like the fruit of the Holy Spirit, peace, joy, love, mercy, self-control, all of those things. He wants us to be great people. Like he, he wants us to have that inner strength in us. And so sometimes it can be discouraging trying to get to that place, but it's a journey. And he says to lay your life down daily and that can be a struggle and a fight, but it can also be great too. You think, oh yeah, it's your kingdom. Oh yeah, your way's better. Oh yeah, if I just trust you, you say all things work out together for my good. So I just want to encourage you that it's not always rosy. It's not always what you may be hearing these days that it it is difficult and it can be difficult. But you're going to get through it and just stay till the end. Finish the race well. Don't give up. Um, just keep, even if you don't understand, just keep going deeper. It's a lifelong journey and unfortunately he's got to get like a lot of stuff out of us sometimes, right? But there's joy in that and there's happiness and you can't, you can overcome and you will. I believe in you. You can, you can overcome. You can do this. I'm with you. I'm in this fight with you. You can overcome yourself in this world and all its negativity and it's all of its evil. And we can become gentle, humble, loving people that the society needs, that this world needs. He put us here for this time this generation 
and that we can have an impact and an influence. And so, yeah, it's difficult. Yeah, but all good things are difficult, right? When you get there, when you overcome, you finish the race, you're like, yeah, I did it. So you are an overcomer. You can do this. And God is there with you. He will help you. You just ask for his help. He is real. He loves you. He adores you. He's cheering you on. And he does want to spend eternity with you. So don't jump ship. Just keep going. Keep going strong. See you next time. Love you guys.